can probably hear in the background my son's bawling. Um, unfortunately, we had two kids that decided to get sick. Um, both of them have pink eye, and um, one of them, my oldest, has a double ear infection. So, it's time to go get some medicine for the pink eye. Um, Sunday, we've they've not been feeling good pretty much the whole week, but it kind of hit a threshold just recently, so they've not been sleeping well. My wife has been not sleeping well because, you know, she's pregnant and due any moment, so I'm going to go get some medicine. Hopefully things feel better. I will say that it's been stressful not only because, I mean, it's pregnancy, it's a major surgery, and pink eye is no fun, but um, my wife took a week off early because the other two children were born early, and so we wanted to try to maximize as much time we could with the kids. Um, but she feels like she's kind of wasting that, and I don't blame her in that process because she wants to be able to spend as much time and not just be sitting at home pregnant. So I just finished up, got the medicine. Um, I will say there is one benefit to all of this that's happened recently. I had got a new position, I think I told you guys about that, where I'm going to be the clinician at an opioid treatment center we're opening. It's going to be a 30 day residential treatment center. It was really difficult because a lot of the clients that we were going to have for that, um, we had to ask them to hold off because we had a pipe burst. And with that pipe burst, um, these people are trying to detox and detoxing from opiates is really bad. But starting tomorrow, um, since today's Sunday, Starting tomorrow, I actually get to start that job. So I actually get to start helping those people in that process. So it'll be a lot of fun to try out a new position. We'll see how that goes. I did have to stop getting my wife a decaf. Um, being pregnant, she does like her coffee. So get a little bit of that for her as well. So it is, it is Tuesday. My voice sounds a lot different. That cold that I was talking about my children having, I now have. And um, it hasn't kept me away from work yet, but I'm afraid that if my wife goes into labor any minute, then I'm gonna be sick in the delivery room. Oh my goodness. So we'll see how it goes. That being said, I did get to spend my first day at the opioid treatment center. That was really cool. Um, got to admit a couple people, got to get them settled in. I already did a therapy group with them. So that was a lot of fun. Hold on Grant, wait, go get more real quick for the camera. Go get more for the camera. So it was a lot of fun to be able to see that little bit of a transformation, especially whenever um, it's something that's so meaningful and so difficult for them to do. Whoa! So just, I don't know about you guys, but I'm one of those people that when you start work, um, it for me, Monday is an exciting time. 
Monday is that I get to go to work, I get to go help people, um, I get to make differences directly in someone's life. And so for me, Monday is exciting. Fridays, I can't believe it's the weekend. Thank goodness I get to go rest. Um, but I go all out during the week. I make sure every day is meaningful. All my prep work's done. Every client I've given 110% in that process. Um, even if they decide not to engage in therapy, I've done what I needed to do. And for me, that's exciting. So um, hopefully I'll get over the sickness. Hopefully the baby comes soon. And you guys get to see a video coming out soon. That me gets me to introduce you to our daughter. So we'll see. See you guys. Go! Wow, good job. High five, can I have a high five? Here, give me a high five. Oh, good job. Fist bump, fist bump, boom.